Hi, my name is Tui Tran, and I'm a recent graduate of the Hemong Fellowship Program at Yale. It was very evident from the very first day that I was on campus that uh, this, the faculty here is amazing. Yale has a great reputation in terms of its preeminent scholarship, its leadership in the fields of immuno-oncology, and that was some place where I knew that I could really grow and develop and really focus on the clinical and research questions that I had in mind. I think it just in terms of the environment at Yale, it's collaborative, it's supportive for young investigators, and I think everyone on the faculty is very approachable in terms of fostering ideas and being supportive of new ideas, even if they go against what is considered the central dogma. Towards the end of my fellowship training, um, opportunities for training grants arose. And during that time, we had our first medical oncology training program, a T32, to help support fellows who wanted to do additional basic or clinical research training. Um, and so that was a great opportunity. There are usually uh, four to five fellows on the training grants each year. Uh, and so that was a great bridge to try to apply for K funding. So now I, I did the T32 for a year and I was successful in getting a K-12, which is the Paul Calabrese Immuno-Oncology Early Career um, uh, Grant. And so currently I'm on that now as a young investigator. And so that allows me the opportunity to focus on my research and keep doing the research that I've been doing uh, as a fellow, but also gives me uh, added clinical opportunities within the melanoma research team uh, to see patients and to be involved in the clinical trials that I'll be recruiting patients to. New Haven is one of those cities where it's not too big, it's not too small. And if you do like big cities, um, it's a few hours away, you can decide whether you wanna to go to Boston or New York City. And so the comforts, if you wanted to go to a big city are there. If you wanted to try some fancy upscale restaurant, it's there. And also New Haven, has a lot of outdoor activities for people who want to go hiking, uh, want to explore the region. If you want to do sailing, we're on the coast, and so it's really nice. You know, the fellowship program has made sure that the, all the fellows have access to the things that they need. For, for example, mothers who are considering breastfeeding, that they have access to the lactation rooms um, that are available also within the hospital, but also within the School of Medicine. Uh, so those resources are available. And I think that collectively and unofficially, we have a, a little mother's group within the fellowship program for advice, which is not exclusive to women. There have been a lot of expectant first-time fathers within the fellowship program too. I think there's a lot of opportunity to grow, to teach, and to develop yourself as an independent person uh, as part of this amazing team.